Who here hasn't been to space? Why? <laughs> you better not throw up on my ship. Approaching jump in three, two, one. All right. So we've talked about this here before. Um, I, for whatever reason, I did not clip it in, to being its own individual <laughs> video. But we've talked about this before, and that was that Sentry or Hyperion were going to be showing up in uh, the Thunderbolts film. And I originally thought it's surely got to be Hyperion over Sentry because the rumor also said that it was going to be a Superman type villain. Now, obviously, that could still be Sentry. But anytime we think Superman type hero in, at least for me, I can't speak for everyone, uh, hero in Marvel, my mind goes to like your Blue Marvels or Hyperion. Uh, or especially when you say evil Superman, it definitely goes to Hyperion. And that's what the rumor was calling for, was a, an evil Superman that was going to be uh, portrayed as the main villain. And so, um, but it looks like it's going to be Sentry. And they've actually got some more news here than what we talked about the last time. And again, this is coming from MovieWeb. Uh, this says, with that introduction in history books, it's been rumored that none uh, none other than Sentry will be the main villain in the upcoming Marvel Cinematic Universe movie Thunderbolt. Slated for 2024 release, the anti-hero team-up will feature many characters that, that MCU fans are already familiar with. Some names including Florence Pugh as Yelena, uh, David Arbor as the Red Guardian, uh, Sebastian Stan as Bucky, and Wyatt Russell as U.S. Agent. Led by Julia Louise Dreyfus, playing the charming, cold Valentina Allegra de Fontaine, the Thunderbolts will make their long-awaited debut by going by going on a dangerous mission for the government. Uh, so will so who will they be up against? And then that's what it's talking about. Century. Um, then it says Daniel <clears throat> Richmond, an entertainment industry insider, revealed through his Patreon that Marvel Studios is eyeing Ryan Gosling to. I still can't picture that though. Uh, Ryan Gosling. Well, to play a comic book accurate version of Sentry. Comic book accurate. Huh. Okay, we'll see. Well, we'll see. We know how jacked he is. So yeah. <laughs> clearly, he's got the build for it, right? And it says, uh, Marvel's own version of Superman, but with a twist as noble as Reynolds wants to stand for, a terrible and evil force quietly lives within his own psyche called the Void. Uh, but they, one thing they didn't mention here, because um, now it's going in talking about the Void, and again, I don't. Uh, we'll, we'll go on this, though. Yeah, it might be here. A particular storyline from the comics may very well become the crucial link between the Thunderbolts team and Sentry. Within the pages of the New Avengers first annual in 20 in 2006, Jelena Bolovo is uh, Belova, sorry, is looking for revenge against the team after a dangerous mission lands her in the hospital almost upon death's door. So, I'm sorry, she had to accept an offer from Hydra agents who held her held her but in turn implanted her with the powers of a super adaptoid in exchange she was uh, tasked with destroying the new avengers reaching their reaching their location she uses her newfound set of abilities to mimic the powers of sentry who is also there before hydra ends up completely subduing her with a fail safe switch built within the with built within the android's machinery due to the void's lingering threat uh, Yelena, who now harnesses great power, uh, decimates Captain Marvel in the original Sentry himself. Uh, considering the fact that none of the Thunderbolts can come anywhere close to Sentry's power level, one would think that this fight would be over instantaneously. And we've talked about that. Like, I don't see what the Thunderbolts are doing with a Hyperion or a Sentry. Like, there's, right. there's no, <laughs> no way. Kidding. Um, then it says, but surprisingly, Robert Reynolds is a man of deep emotion deep emotions instead of facing stark's <laughs> truths uh and coming to terms with shattering events he usually flees the scene not wanting to face reality instead instead of letting the new avengers invite him on their team he vanished when they tried to show him when they tried to show him that his wife was alive the statement was too much to bear so he took flight mr reynolds ended up crying when telling various heroes of the void's impending arrival uh, then it says Sentry also ran away to another planet, to another planet, Saturn, because the Void lied, because the Void lied to him about the Scroll invasion being entirely his fault, as as supposed as supposed consequences created created by all the people who forgot him. If our team of antiheroes has any chance of subduing the godlike character, they will have to put aside the physical fight, unless they can unless they can get their hands on a copycat ability and take advantage of the traumatized um yeah, 
the scroll invasion could come the scroll invasion could come into play on the big screen since secret invasion is coming to disney plus soon but as they still didn't mention it here um that uh dreyfus is going to be involved with the creation of century we're going to see his creation in 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 the film is what the rumor said uh, that also that daniel talked about so i don't know why they didn't say that but um so that dreyfus is going to be involved with the creation of century in the film so we should if the rumors are true and we've heard this before you know again the hyperion century thing so it looks like it's going to be century i truly believe he's going to be in the film i really hope it's not ryan gosling i don't now has, has ryan gosling played other like villainous roles am i missing something he did like drive that was kind of like a little bit like darker edgier I'm trying to think what else not really i mean he's yeah the titans and notebook that's and, my mind know, always goes crazy, to remember the titans love. like it's those yeah yeah it's gonna be like you stole something that's all i ever think and then the, now he's in he's ken and barbie so I, you're, <laughs> he's, ken and barbie? he's ken in the new barbie movie i mean so i don't know but um come on <laughs> but uh he's also not victor von doom yeah he's also not victor von doom that was rumored as well um, it's really interesting, though, to see that the uh, that Sentry is going to be entering into the MCU. Um, I wonder how they're going to handle the Void. I wonder how they're going to handle Sentry himself as far as power yeah, level exactly. goes. Um, yeah, they mentioned Elena having some new found power. I mean, what are... In the comic. In the comic, she did. Uh, so that's what they were saying. Are they, are, are they going to adapt that comic and do that? Because, um, again, as we've talked about, I don't know what this Thunderbolts team does with a Sentry. That's that's. Thunderbolts. Yeah. You need like Captain Marvel or somebody, and even then, it's like tough, you know. And they said, like they said in the article, this fight's over instantaneously. Yeah. <clears throat> There's no way Red Guardian, who's on the team, Red Guardian, Guardian U.S. Guardian, Agent, Bucky, Bucky, Bucky Yelena, 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 yeah. Uh, what's Glitch's name from Ant Man <laughs> Ghost. 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 Ghost Taskmaster. Yeah. Good glitch. I mean, if we get Red Hulk, he at least have someone strong. There it is. There it is. Sorry, I forgot about that. There's the Sentry's power Red level. Hulk. Yeah. Red Hulk. If Thunderbolt Ross is going to turn into Red Hulk in, in the Thunderbolts film, there it is. Um, and I hope, I hope, I hope when they keep. Come out? 2024. That's before yeah. or after it, cap? I believe it's the end of... Is it after Cap or before Cap? After. It's after. the end okay, of Phase so that 5. that makes sense that he'd be Red Hulk. All the Hulk's up in there. Yeah, it's the end of Phase 5. Uh, so there it is right there. Uh, I hope they... Uh, as I've said before about the Red Hulk, I hope they keep it the identity of him. Because like, when he first showed up in... What, it was 08 that he showed up in Marvel Comics. Mm -hmm. Nobody knew who the fuck he was right. for the longest. Nobody knew who Red. Hulk, nobody knew he was Thunderbolt Ross. So I hope that they keep it that way. I hope that they right. keep that it's you know Thunderbolt Ross's <laughs> identity uh, a secret. But there, that's the that's the only power that you would have in, within that team to come in and take on Sentry. Right. Yeah. It's the only strength level. But even even still, that it's like <clears throat> he doesn't have mm -hmm. a lot to counter. But besides strength and power and durability, right. like he doesn't have any of the other like superman like abilities like flying around and he, he can like emit stuff too right like mm -hmm. he's not just like super strength yeah so no, it's he's not like, super strength. even then it's like you're asking a lot even of red hulk to be able to like keep That's up true. with that type of a thing and like speed like hulk strong but the hulk he's not as fast as sentry but if we are going if we are going with the comic at least i hope we're going with the comic version of that way the hulk works mm-hmm like the, the, he, the matter he gets, the stronger he gets, yeah. and that's right. not just Bruce, is no. it? That's no, it's I even think, more so with gets, with Red Hulk. He like starts he at a hot. Yeah, he yeah. gets. I was about to say okay, they yeah, all yeah. get different because you know mm -hmm. She Hulk's is she doesn't get mad or right. anything. Like she's able to can be herself and everything. So mm -hmm. I for, I think yeah, like you said, his he gets hot and everything. But I even like I mean, a, flame sometimes doesn't. Yeah, it? I was about to say, but I mean, yeah. unless they the Thunderbolts, even mm -hmm. with mm -hmm. Red Hulk. I mean, they attack him, like, from some sort of mental, emotional aspect. that They're not mm. going to physically beat Sentry, even if no, they have right. the Red Hulk. No, no, no. That's what I was saying. Even if you, even if they have the Hulk, Red Hulk, it it's just like, oh, okay, now it's, a, now it's a fight. But, yeah, it's, it's kind of <laughs> like, like uh, World War Hulk. 
the Sentry was the only one that could stop Hulk in that comic run, and mm-hmm. it became it was a it was a tie, it was a draw. Like they both just powered each other out. Yeah. Um. So I'm I. I yeah. I, I hope that I hope that it's. Because that would be our first time seeing Red Hulk, I'm assuming, too. No, unless we see him in Captain America. New World Order. Mm-hmm. I don't think we see Red Hulk in New World Order. That wasn't the rumor. The rumor was... Oh, yeah, it was. It was uh, multiple Hulks, wasn't it? It was multiple it? Hulks. Whatever that means. Yeah, yeah. Um, him, but, Scar, and <laughs> S.H.I.E.L.D. But how much... I mean, they could even be saying this, and it's rumored uh, a good amount of the Hulks that make it plural is, like, in credit scenes. You know, that too. Like that we, too. We get like Thunderbolt Ross like at the very end. Didn't you say too last time we were talking about this in the comics he was like President Ross at the same time too? No, he's never been. He's never been uh, President Sectors. President uh, Thunderbolt Ross in the uh-huh. comics. Uh, but he's going to be President Thunderbolt Ross in the MCU. Oh, okay, that's what it was. That's okay. what. It, yeah, that's what it's going to be. He's going to be. Uh, I think what was that a New World Order? I think is what we were guessing is he's mm-hmm. going to be probably turn into President Hulk, so or President Thunderbolt Ross. Mm-hmm. So yeah, um, yeah, that's the thing. That's the things going on that we know so far going on with the Sentry and um, Thunderbolts and him being the villain in that uh, villain villain. Right. Right. Think yeah. Namor. I, that's what I'm gonna say. Think yeah. Namor with this because ultimately yeah. he is gonna join the good guys Wait, and how many the Secret Wars right, and everything like that. How many times have they done that? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Seeing a, a character as the villain, and then oh, hey, we got him. Nobody this can thing ever together. just be bad, yeah. just no, to be bad. No. <laughs> no one can ever be bad just to be bad. But yeah, yeah so uh, let us know down below in the comments what you guys are thinking. Actually, you know what? I don't even think I put that. Yeah, I did. Let us know down below in the comments what you guys are thinking of uh, some of the news going on there with Sentry showing up in the Thunderbolts film. And um, what are you thinking of how they're going to handle him? What are you thinking uh, about how the Thunderbolts themselves are going to handle Sentry? And how do you think they are going to handle the void if the void is even something that they do? Let us know down below what you guys are thinking.